Skippy here from Skippy Six Gaming, coming to you with episode six of the God Vault. Uh, last we left it, we had segregated stuff that was going to get cooked. All the stuff that's going to get cooked is here, and we have a nice minecart system taking all of our fuel and automatically smelting those things. So, what <laughs> this one here, guys, we are going a little buck wild. I'm not even joking. So, what I did here was basically we have five items. If you look down here, from here over are all cooked items. So like cooked steak, cooked chicken, cooked pork chops, cooked potatoes. And then over here is sand and stuff like that. I did move sand over because it was out of place. But sand, iron, uh, sand, iron, uh, nether quartz, and gold. So what we're going to do here is I've decided to make... A food shower. <laughs> I know it's crazy, but I think I could do it. Um, ultimately, all the food that you're going to eat in the game are coming from these suckers right here. Uh, I just made a few more quick sorters just to sort out the other things you could possibly eat in the game. And then what we're going to do is make it all go to a stream where it just constantly falls in a stream. All you got to do is just walk under it and grab all the food you want. Whatever food you don't grab is just going to go back into it, into an item elevator, and back into the cycle. That way, there will be no chests where you actually have to pick up food. It will be irrelevant because all you have to do is walk here grab whatever you need and keep going and it'll just keep cycling through uh maybe totally ludicrous maybe uh unneeded but i think it'll look pretty cool so let's jump in i'm gonna grab some stuff in my hot bar and we'll get this one done okay so now that we've got this mission accomplished basically guys what we're gonna do is take all of these are food items so what we want to do now is make a little scaffolding uh Let's do this, and what we're going to want is for these hoppers to now go into this guy. So, let's go ahead and get rid of this, get rid of this, get rid of all these. Oh, there goes all the fish! And let's go ahead and create a scaffolding for ourselves here, just to do what we need to do. Grab hoppers. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do that. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is totally one of the most ridiculous things ever done in Minecraft, but I'm betting by the end of this episode, guys, you're going to be stoked because you're going to have a food shower. I don't know, but that sounds pretty cool to me. Uh, grab these guys, these guys, these guys. Make sure it goes into this guy, into this guy, into this guy, into this guy. So, and then the other thing that's going to happen is ultimately you won't even have to put food in the sorter anymore if you really don't want to. Uh, oh no, my batteries are dying, really? We can finish this episode before it dies, I don't care. Uh, this guy, this guy. So now all the food stuffs is coming out into this guy right here. Once they come out to this guy right here, let's go ahead and put a chest right here. Into this chest right here, okay. Grab, we shouldn't have got rid of the block of quartz. This will be like the bet of the day. Will, will Skippy get through the tutorial before his controller dies? Uh, I don't think. I think we'll have to be fine. So this guy's going to go here. This guy's going to go here. We're going to throw this into this. And then we're going to throw this into this. And then throw a dropper right here. Oh, looking good, looking good. So basically what we're going to have right here is this is going to shoot the items out. So that's good. Let's just finish our uh, circuit here, which is going to allow us to shoot items out. So let's go grab uh, some redstone. We're going to grab comparator. Oh, I should have just grabbed it all. So we need comparator, we need redstone dust, and we need a block, which we have. So grab this. Comparator. Oh, I didn't grab my repeaters. Okay, this guy here. We're going to need a block of choice right here. We're going to need some repeaters. Let's grab a repeater. So now that we've done this, repeater out of this guy. Repeater into this guy. Redstone dust over here, 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 and here. So now anything that comes out of the system is going to go here, is going to get shot out. No. So once it gets shot out, what we are going to try to do here, so basically all the food from this guy is going to come down and also get shot out. So what we're going to have to do is let's go ahead and build this guy out. Not there though. Let's build it down. And we want these guys to shoot out too. 
so hopefully it's going to all be in the same water stream that would be pretty cool um so let's try to build this guy down first of all let's get rid of this we're going to try to move this over so it's flush in a perfect world we're going to have it shooting out right here so it shoots all into the same stream uh let's go ahead and take a dropper which we're going to want to be right there so let's go ahead you know what we're going to do we're going to extend this that's good okay so now that this dropper this goes here shoots out to here we're going to want to put the dropper on this same system right underneath this guy so dropper there <laughs> looking good this is gonna be so gangsta okay so that guy there so now that we've done this let's go ahead and uh put a dropper which i already got out of my hot bar let's get this guy oh why'd i do that hopper and we could most likely just continue the hoppers from the top which is what we're going to do actually okay so grab our hoppers hmm that's okay let's bring it up grab our hoppers hopper hopper so it looks like all of our food is now going to find its way down to this guy right here so let's go ahead with my poor hot bar maintenance we're going to need another one of these we got our dropper that's good so let's go ahead here and finish our circuit we're going to be putting a comparator out of this guy and then we're going to be putting this guy here grab yourself some repeaters repeater into this guy repeater out of this guy dust 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 and mission semi-accomplished so let's go here get rid of some of this scaffolding which is unnecessary this guy this guy do don't need this guy this guy let's leave this front bar up here so that we know where our aim is but as you can see as of right now guys this is all going to filter to one area so you know what i'm going to do actually i think we're going to make this a little bit overwhelming uh, let's go ahead and grab some glass and let's go ahead and build this up let's build I think we're gonna have to mess with some water here in a funky way this guy here let's go ahead and put glass here and then oh you know what? we're gonna have to lower that a little bit so let's lower this down one there we go we got to do that we have no choice because we don't want the items to shoot over the top so once we do this oh yeah it's looking good looking good looking good and then we're going to basically have all of our food go to a central point looking good grab this guy right here So now we're going to mess with our water flow because it's going to be a little tricky. Okay, so what we could have is, so before we even start this, I'm just going to fill this all up that way. We don't have a huge mess because we're only part the way there. We're seven minutes. We're going to have to create another item elevator at the bottom here. So we'll get that done. Don't worry. Hopefully this is going to be enough. I'm trying to think about how we're just going to get it to segregate to one area. Okay, so I'm thinking our water flow won't be too bad. If we just put one right there and one right there, that's okay. <laughs> Remember what I was saying? <laughs> Let's not make a mess. Oh, well. So basically what we are going to do is... I hope I didn't mess any redstone up. Okay, so as you can see right now, everything flows out. If you throw something in there, it's going to go there. What if we throw it in the corner here? Even there will find its way. As long as everything finds its way right there, we're good. This is now going to be our shower. So let's go ahead and drop down. Right here and right here.
Okay, so now we're cooking with gas. Let's go ahead and clean some of this up. A lot of this glass is going to be gone when we're done. If it all falls down here. So now we're going to get the fun part. So now we're going to have to bring an item elevator uh, back from the ground here, back up here, so that any items that flow through are just going to get shot back into this. So let's do it. <laughs> this is the fun part that starts right now. So what we're going to have to remember is, I'm going to try to do this in not too long of an episode, is... We're going to remember our rules for item elevators. As you can see, this one here, we came from this direction. And then we went to the right. Follow the item elevator rules, but as you can see, we're going to want to do the exact same thing. So, what's going to happen here is we are going to take our first hopper and our hopper is going to be right here. That one's going to be the down. So let's just start let's just start clearing this out. And then what we're going to do is connect all of our hoppers into that guy. As long as they all head to this hopper eventually, then we're good. I'm just going to put this cuz I just want it to all go. That guy goes in there, that guy goes in there. That guy goes in there, that guy goes in there, that guy goes in there. That guy goes in there, in there, in there, in there. So now we have it so when all items fall down, they go in there. But what we're going to want it to do is basically go this way into another water stream, item elevator up, and into there again. So. Let's go. We've decided that this one here is going to be our main hopper that goes down. So let's go down here and make sure. As you can see, this is the one that goes down. So what it's going to do is let's go ahead and start clearing out some space. Hopefully this won't be too long of an episode, but I think it'll be pretty dope when it's done. Um, this guy here is all going to go into a chest. Or actually, you know what we could do? We can make uh, this guy go into a hopper down. Then we're going to put a dropper there. Dropper. Okay, so now what we got to do is go ahead and make our instant shooter system coming up right now. We'll fill this in after. And that's going to go to comparator, to this block, get rid of this block, throw a repeater, repeater, get rid of this guy, grab this, 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 this. So now it's going to automatically shoot. So now what we got to do is finish our item elevator. So this is going to be two, then this way. So basically what we're going to want to do is I'm just going to hammer out this whole area here. Okay, so let's just clean this whole thing out. We'll make it look pretty after. So now what we're going to do is go ahead and put our block of quartz right here. That's going to bring our waterways up. Grab some ice. Put these guys here. Let's throw our bucket of water to see how far it goes because I've already gone too far, I'm pretty sure. As it goes here, this one here is going to be ice. This one here is going to be a solid block. Then we're going to put a solid block there. Then what we have to make sure, guys, is that we have our 3x3. Three three. So this bottom block here is transparent. Then what we're going to do is make sure that this one down here has to be solid. So once this is done, let's clear this out. And we're going to make our 9, our 3x3 three three for our item elevator right here. Looking good, looking good, looking good, looking good, looking good. Grab some fence posts. I'm going to put fence posts there. Fence posts there. Go straight ahead. Then we're going to put 
So hopefully this one works as it stands. I hope so. I wonder if there's like a limit. If you have too many in your world, if it would be bad. But in a perfect world, this is going to go up. We're going to have another item elevator in our vault area to look pretty cool. We'll have that guy, that guy, that guy. So let's go ahead and say throw a pork chop here. Pork chop comes through. And it goes up the item elevator. Okay, so mission accomplished. So what we're going to do now is bring these up. Basically, our goal now is to bring this item elevator up. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Put this guy here, this guy here. Again, we'll work on the finer details after the fact. I'm telling you, I've never had a food shower before. This is going to be a food shower. I made a pork chop shower kind of, and this is a little bit. This, the other one used a lot more redstone, and look, we're missing something right here. See, you can't have that. That's going to be bad. Things will leak. So put this guy here. Okay, so now what we're going to want to do is let's go ahead and start with, uh, you know, I'm going to do it one more high because it's always better to be one higher than lower. So let's get rid of this guy, this guy. Let's put a chest right here. We're going to need some hoppers, hella hoppers coming right up. This is pretty good. It's only 16 minutes. This is going to be a doable episode. Perfect. And so let's put chest right here. No, see, one more higher. I'm telling you, man. It's genius. Genius. And then what we're going to do is. Ultimately, what we want is for this dropper to be uh, right here. Then we're going to want to put a solid block. Ah, yeah, it will work. So we're going to want to put a solid block right here. And then we're going to want a solid block right here, right here, there. Okay, so let's make this one here. So basically, comparator out of this guy, repeater, repeater, redstone dust coming right up. Then we're going to put a hopper into this guy. Okay, so basically, our goal here is going to be hopper into him. Let's just go ahead and make a floor here so we can do what we need to do. Hopper into him, into him, and then let's just go through here, into him. We'll just come out the whole backside here, why not? Hopper into him. So let's leave, let's get out of here. Okay, so the hopper will go into this chest. And then what we need to do is put a hopper going into this guy. Then a hopper going into this guy. And then we're going to cover them up. Okay. So now everything should be cooking with gas. So let's uh, start throwing something in there. Let's say redstone dust. It's going to go up. It went. We just didn't see it. Hold on one sec. We're just going to put it into the proper system because basically you'll see what it did right there to make it go up is it actually ejects it hard and it goes right against this wall is the thing that happens. So hopefully... 
Oh, we're missing some glass. I knew it. I told you every time. So let's go ahead and put the glass right here. And we'll try that one more time. Anything that comes here is going to go onto those hoppers, shoots it fast, hits the thing, goes up the elevator. Shoots in and falls back down. Look at that. Okay, so mission accomplished. So let's get rid of this stuff. Let's start making it look pretty. Okay, so first things first, let's grab some stone. I'm loving it. Only 20 minutes this video. Okay, so stone. Let's close this bad boy up. Perfect. Close this guy up. Then we're going to grab some carpet. We'll just use gray. This is going to be so wicked to watch when it works at the end. I'm telling you. No need for chests of food. Just walk over here. And it's already cooks your food and everything. So that said, we should be testing this bad boy out right now. Uh, let's go fix the floor here because it doesn't look so pretty. Wow, this is going to be super exciting. I'm pretty stoked about this right now. The first food shower is about to hit off right here. Okay, so let's go here. So we need to make some food come into the shower. Let's go ahead and put all of these different items. So first things first, let's grab... You know what, let's clear my whole bar. Let's grab a... Uh... There we go, a bunch of raw beef. So that said, you do not want to put cooked product in here because it's not going to have a segregation for it. Um, so at the end of the day, if there is no furnaces here, which there isn't, you won't be able to cook it anyway. So let's go and grab, say... A stack of melons, stack of bread, stack of cookies, uh, some raw fish, and say like a stack of pie and this. So all this stuff we could just put in the system. And the one thing is I turned off my smelter, so let's just go turn it back on right here. And I'm pretty sure that our food shower is going to start any minute. It is going to be pretty epic. I think we're going to end up putting some glass here. Oh, there we go. It's cooking. And then what's going to happen? And then it comes back up here. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming, and then it's just going to keep flowing. <laughs> it totally is working perfectly, guys. As you can see, the food shower. <laughs> I love it, love it, love it. Um, all your cook, look, cooked pork chops are coming out now. Cooked pork chops, cooked everything. Whatever it is, you could just put yourself like, uh, you know what? Let's put a, let's put a fence around it. I don't know something, <laughs> something to stop the coolness. But there you go. Let's even get rid of these. <laughs> I'm so happy with myself right now. And there you go. Whenever you want some food, you walk up here. <laughs> Raining food, bro. And then it comes right back in. If you really want it, guys, if it's already a cooked product, anything you throw in here will just go straight into your into your food. So anything you want here, guys, you just throw it right back in. And there you go. We have the first Minecraft food shower on console edition. See this, though? First uh, imperfection. Let's go ahead and... Uh, 
bet you if we just do that, we can just do this to uh, leave any problems. Put this guy right here. <laughs> Look at them all. It's because these hoppers are full right now, which is causing the trouble, but those suckers will get picked up in a second. You know what we do, actually? There you go. Perfect. I love it. Love it. Love it. Let's just block this guy off, too, a little bit. Perfect. The food shower is going. Okay, guys, on that note... Don't forget to smash that like. Don't forget as well to subscribe to my channel. If you want to see Minecraft food showers in the Wicked God Vault, uh, share this video on social media with your friends if you're down with the party. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you on the next one.